Hey YouTube, Paraborn here, back again with another video for you guys. And today I'm going to be comparing Ultra Compost and Super Compost. I hope you enjoy. So as most of you know, I recently did a video in which I calculated the amount of herbs we can get per seed when using Super Compost on those herbs. And that came out to 7.2 herbs per seed. And now I wanted to test exactly how many herbs per seed we could get with Ultra Compost so we can find out exactly how much more profitable it is to be using Ultra Compost. So to calculate this, I decided on a sample size of 100 seeds. Now obviously that's not the biggest sample size, but I do think it will end up being pretty accurate. Those 100 seeds yielded 892 herbs, which averages out to 8.92 herbs per seed, which is 1.72 more herbs per seed than Super Compost which is actually quite a lot, guys. Ultra Compost is about 1,500 GP more than Super Compost right now, which means if you're making 1,500 GP from those 1.72 herbs you're getting, then you are gonna be profiting more using Ultra Compost, which is almost always the case with any herb you would want to do. The only exceptions are dwarf weeds and irit, and also any of the lower level herbs, you wouldn't wanna do those with Ultra Compost, but every other herb you would do for profit you're definitely going to want to be using Ultra Compost to maximize that profit. So as I mentioned earlier, I got 892 herbs from the seeds, which I sold for 2.136 mil. The cost of the herbs and the Ultra Compost was about 360k, which means I did profit about 1.8 mil in the... If I had used Super Compost, my profit would have been about 1.5 mil, which means I would have made 300k less. So you can see how that can quickly add up. I definitely recommend always using Ultra Compost even if you have the Fertile Soil spell unlocked for the Lunar Spellbook. Especially if any of you are harvesting the high cost herbs like Renars, Snapdragons, or Torstals, this will definitely help you the most. I'm planning on making a video soon with this new information that we found and figuring out exactly what the best herb to farm is for profit. So make sure you hit that subscribe button so you can see that when it's made. And I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you in the next one.